Aaron Henning can still relate to days gone by while running the family business. Volleyball taught me a lot about managing people and doing that, and that's what I do. I manage people and deal with problems, and, <laughs> and I'm like a lot of that I learned throughout my volleyball career. The Hennings have owned Windsor Plywood in Grand Prairie, Alberta for close to 30 years. The store has been a staple in Aaron's life, and so has sport. Sports were always a way of doing things as a family and like getting out there and like being together, but then I also got very competitive at a young age, so it was a good way to put me into something that I could be competitive and not rival my brother all the time. As volleyball became a constant with Henning, a lifelong bond was developed with Lee Carter. They won an Alberta College Championship together in 2004-2005. The following year, Carter led the first ever B women's volleyball team, and Henning was among his first recruits. We've been through a lot together, but you know, like somebody's like, oh, I could never play for the same coach. And I'm like, well, Lee, Lee was evolving as a coach and so knowledgeable. It was, for me, it was just amazing to watch because he did so much to help us learn. Henning later moved on to the coaching ranks and unique opportunities would follow, including the Arctic Winter Games. The event sees representation from across the world. Henning competed in two games as an athlete and the experience allowed her to pay it forward. The girls were just like, what are we doing? Why are we doing this? And I was like, I never experienced it because we didn't really know when I played. So I was like, you guys need to experience something culturally so different. And we went and it was just, they were just in shock and awe at all these other sports that nobody knows about. <laughs> she also guided Alberta to a gold medal at the North American Indigenous Games. Those girls are athletes and they want to play they just give everything for playing volleyball. Henning continues to coach and stock shelves back home. Being a Bobcat gave her the structure she needed for the long haul. You know, it's always going to be a part of who I was and who I am. And I don't, I know every, not everybody gets the same experience, but it definitely was, you know, three or four years of my life that has shaped who I am now.